Welcome back to Piers Morgan Uncensored. We all know Muller yogurts, these creamy treats with crunchy or fruity bits in the corner. Other equally delicious brands are available. Apparently, all yogurts are evil. They're murderous. A vegan charity has released an ad about them that will give you nightmares. A warning, you might find this disturbing. New from Killer Yogurts. The umbilical cord flavor. Produced with only the finest ingredients the stolen milk of grieving mothers. Taste the torment in every mouthful. Blended with brutality. Be complicit. With killer yogurts. Well, I'm joined now by the director of the charity, Viva, who made the ad, Juliet Galatoly. Well, Juliet. I've got to be honest, that's one of the most disgusting things I think I've ever had to watch. It's also one of the most disingenuous. It's a yoghurt, for goodness sake. Why are you making ads like that about a yoghurt? I'm sorry, I don't believe that that's the most dis disgusting thing in your editorial career that you've Pretty much seen. one of them, no, I've got to be honest. I'm sorry, it's a pantomime style. It's obviously a parody. It's obviously fake blood. Um, you know, over three million people saw it. Um, but what's your and, point? And the, and the, well, the point is we went into and investigated dairy farming mm. and blew apart the notion that these animals are in idil. Most one, of, one in five of the animals and supplying people like that were zero graze. This means they never saw a blade of grass. Mm. And I went, so I went in myself to check this out and they're in filthy conditions. The male calves taken away and shot or knifed in the throat because they don't produce milk. The mothers, when their milk production went down, killed. So there's a lot of death in the dairy. Well, let me ask you. Let me ask you. This, let me ask you this. What do you think happens in the wild? How do you think animals eat? What species are you talking? Well, you're about? very you're very concerned <laughs> about the protection of animals. But if you go to the African bush, animals eat each other all day long in the most savage, primeval way. Why aren't you campaigning about that? Yeah, Why don't you go and protect animals from other animals? Yeah, listen, my degree is zoology. I know quite a lot about animals. And so they, you see the not, and they are on my not TikTok pigs, feed, all I see all day pigs, are lions pigs, destroying gazelles' Come heads. on, they're not, which is a bit more gory than that. They're not it's factory real life. farmed. They're not factory farmed. Mm. These animals never see sunlight. They never graze a blade of grass. Mm. It's obscene. I don't think even you would agree with that. Well, I always, I, my problem with vegans is this. I mean, I bet you're a, you probably like almonds, do you? Oh, no, you're not going to do the almond avocado with me. No, this just is asking boring. you, do no, you... This, this is boring. I'm, it no. may be boring. No, 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 I no. actually find the vegan assault on meat eaters is boring. So do you eat avocados and almonds? I'm not assaulting anybody. Do you eat them? Anybody. Do you eat them? I eat them from Spain. So you do? You eat avocados Spain, and almonds? Spain, because the issues that you talk and, and about... And do you drink... About the what bees, kind of milk do you drink? You're talking about the murder... What kind of milk do you drink? You talk about the murder... Soya. Soya, OK. Yeah. So, you talk about the murder of bees in other interviews. Yes, because vegans but you don't, don't care. care. But you don't care about the billions no. of calves and no. chicks and piglets. I understand. Kill. So you're a complete hypocrite. No, I'm not. You are pigs. No, the hypocrites are the vegans no, who munch not. away on almonds <laughs> and, and their avocados and no. stuff. They don't give a damn about billions of bees getting no, annihilated. That's Because the bees rubbish. are the little guys. It's and I have this conversation each time because that's the hypocrisy. I don't care. You're obsessed with this no, because you think it catches I am a out. proud... Listen, and happy meat Piers, and yogurt Piers, eater. We're in the when you try and make out this yogurt is the most evil thing that anyone Piers, can eat in the world, I think you're bonkers to the We're in a six mass extinction. We're living it now. You're behaving like a news anchor on the film. I'm, I'm, I'm in the what? You're behaving like a news anchor on what the film. Extinction? Don't look up. What we're extinction? in the six mass extinction. You're deflecting all the time from the world. The world real is issues. not going to end you because are trying I to deflect because I eat from a muller yogurt. Look, animals what? Animals are factory farmed. You're trying to deflect look, from the fact the world's still here. Veganism protects the environment. Juliet, we're still here. We are, but how Nobody's much longer extinct. have we got? You've got kids. You must care about the climate crisis. I let my kids eat meat. I let them eat yoghurt. And you know what? I don't think it's evil. You must care about the climate crisis and you must be aware that the University of Oxford has specifically stated that a vegan diet, it protects the really? environment. Really? But you just it said, you, you, just said you, eat your, you said it you really, got your eat it, almonds or avocados from Spain. Which one? From Spain. Which one? Both. I don't eat almonds, actually. How do they get here? Avocados. How do they get here? Boat. 
Bones. Really? Yeah. You sure? Yes, I am sure. You sure? I am absolutely sure. Really? And how do you think most vegans get most of their almonds and avocados from California? And how do you boats? think most no, they don't. meat eaters get their No, they don't. Their, their they don't get them from a boat. They get <laughs> how them do on you planes. Think meat eaters get their and they get them on planes which guzzle up the environment. Do you eat avocados? Yes. But you care about all these millions of bees being no, killed. No, I care about your hypocrisy about no, the little guys. rubbish. I do. Most bees are killed because of overuse of pesticides. Most overuse not of true. pesticides not true. is due to the way that it's the land the poli- is farmed in the poli- to, no, no, to, to no, grow is not fodder true. for farmed that is, animals. That is not so true. So you're talking rubbish. Most of the bees get killed in the pollination process. Rubbish. And by the way, after they get killed, you g- vegans get all your almonds and avocados flown over on these gas-guzzling planes. And my point is, I like to fly, I like to eat meat, I like to eat yoghurts. I'm just fed up with vegans trying to shame me for it when you're all such hypocrites no, when it comes to the bees. No, you're not. You're against factory farming. If you went inside the farms that I've been inside and the reason that I set up Viva, the state of the animals that I've seen them in, pigs Julia, know, dying in front of me... If this makes me evil, not, you would if this makes me it. evil, I am happy you're to not, be evil. It's disgusting. It's delicious. Julia Galadali, lovely to see you. That's it from me. Whatever you're up to, keep it creamy.